Hello, welcome to your 33rd C++ lesson, and in this lesson we're just going to learn about deleting allocated memory. Okay, so I'm just going to paste in our basic program structure, because I'm too lazy to type it. And, right, so we have iStream, h using namespace standard, we have our main function, which just gets a character and returns zero. Okay, so basically, what this is about is any time you use the new keyword, it actually allocates memory for your variable, and we have to clear that memory, otherwise it is just kept in the system. So... Let's just say int, int, because I'm just that inventive, equals new int. So we have an int pointer, and it's just set to a new int. And all we're going to do is make another variable called int var, and it's going to equal any number you like. Mine's just going to be 5. We're then going to set our int pointer to var. Okay, and then we're going to see out int. Now, the only problem with this is the int pointer is actually allocated memory in which it stored the memory address of var. So if I debug this now, it's going to work fine, and it should output 5. There we go. However, the memory for the pointer is still stored in my system right now as I'm speaking. Now, that is the only problem with using the new keyword. Uh, it doesn't actually clean up after you, as it will with other types of variables. So to clean this up, what we need to do is we type delete and then int. Now, what we don't do is say delete asterisk int. Now, this is because this would delete var, basically. And we don't want to delete var, we want to delete int itself. So, no asterisks, delete int. And that should still work exactly the same. We won't be able to use the int pointer after this point, And it has cleared it from our system. Okay, so that's still outputted 5. Okay, remember to clear up this memory, or it will clog up your system with tons of different variables and things which you don't actually need anymore. So delete is an important keyword, make sure you use it whenever you're using the new keyword, especially with pointers and things. Okay, that's the end of this lesson. Have a nice day!